Okay, welcome to another Pro Game Recap. This is a game played in the 47th Meijin uh, League between Ida Atsushi and Shibano Toramaru. So Shibano is black, Ida is black, a uh, white. So uh, at the beginning they started to have a corner fight. Now a black group uh, looks precarious over here on the left hand side. But uh, black is under control all along. So. Okay. Now this white move really threatened black group. So black really have to uh, live with this group. But also notice the corner is not life for white as well so now at this point uh, black is only one move away from living and uh, of course the clamp over here would make black live but the corner for white is not alive so at this point uh, white made a mistake which is this honey and you see why this is a mistake very soon so black ataris and white still has to live in the corner so uh, by hunting underneath it feels like white wants to get some sente uh, yose points and before living but this is actually happens to be a mistake and the reason it's a mistake is because the liberties are a lot tighter after this honey and what this uh, what and basically this made black this move sente so now if white doesn't respond uh, then black has this cut so when obviously this atari doesn't really work because now white's in atari so white atari this way and the funny thing is white cannot atari here nor can white atari here so neither of these atari now works because the liberty is too tight so white will get captured first um, so and that's why this is this is actually a mistake. White should probably just have come here, and that's still alive. And now this black move is now not sente, uh, because light ha white doesn't hasn't tightened one more liberty. And um, so if white if black plays under, white has this jump. So white is still alive in the corner. So but that's a bit of a mistake. It gave black a sente eye over here. Let's continue. But black didn't make use of the sente AI right away. So black will want to try to cause some trouble on the outside for white, which is actually quite successful if you look at the results. So so now black has one more half an eye here and also clamp will give black an eye. So so the black is definitely not alive. So this although it looks precarious, uh, black is actually in control. So black decides to make more trouble for white on the outside uh, cut and extend okay before he says okay enough is enough I'm gonna make use of this sente eye and just make another eye here uh, white, black probably should have played here to make this eye and this eye may eye but this is also fine so now the fighting is over uh, and now notice that this this is a weak black group over here but this white group is also not that strong and it's got two uh, white uh, black stones here and this white group here is also not that strong so this is going to be a very fighting game so let's see, let's continue push 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 comes out so uh, now at this point Ida has two choices one is to take care of this white group even more one is to uh, strengthen this white group and then attack this black group so Ida has chosen to put more pressure on this white group and strengthen his wet white group over here so here Shibano played a very interesting variation push connect push one more and now black tanukis and puts more pressure on this white group over here so if you look at this shape, would you even say that black is fully alive? Now, basically, Shibano thinks so. 
well, why does uh, Shibano Tanuki? So let's look at a few variations. So if white strengthens the corner, then notice that black has almost a center eye over here. Right, so that's one eye. And uh, black can play here. I'm trying to make an eye in the middle. So if white has destroyed the eye in the middle, black can honey out. Now notice that after connection, black can make an, an eye. So if white destroys this side, then black can just do something like this. So notice that this white group is also uh, a little in a little bit of danger. So uh, this is very complicated, and chances are white is not going to come out on top. So so if white protects, then at any point black can play this, but black can also just try and cause more trouble for white. On the outside first, so, uh, so in the, under this variation, it's it's alive. So what if white tries to destroy the center eye at, at the bottom over here? Um, now black still has a few ways to play, but uh, this is the way recommended by AI. Just cut here. So no, notice that now the center almost looks like there's an eye. Okay. Um, of course, letting letting black Atari out like this is not very fun for white. So uh, white will probably want to just connect, <coughs> and then this Atari would be Sente, um, and you can Hane in Sente. So maybe Black just want to get just to be hundred percent safe, just a Atari, and you know Black blocks. Then that's another eye. Now of course you may be thinking, what if White just play here? So Black and Atari take. Now notice that at this point, um, if white blocks, then black can connect like this. So uh, if white tries to protect here, then there are some life and death issues for white. You know? um, so uh, black it might just come out on top over here as well. So overall, uh, Shibano decided that this black group is already alive. Then uh, he tenukis. So this is a really, really beautiful way that that uh, Shibano has played. So let's continue. So Ida, of course, tries to help this group. So Shibano decides to strengthen his group on top, and before attacking the white group again. Um, so now notice that this white group is not alive, but this, that pro white can probably make one eye in the middle and white has to make another eye down at the bottom. So Shibano makes a push. Now notice that there is a push and cut here for white. So, um, but Shibano still decides to make this push over here. This is very interesting choice and you see why later on. And Shibano decides to try and destroy the eye down the bottom. So Ida just played a coup. Now it's really hard to assess for 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 human or, or for lower level players like me, but AI says that at this point black can just play here and just let white live. Just fix all your problems on the outside and black will is winning anyway. But Shibano decides to uh, Atari and make a code that makes it more exciting. Atari. Okay, so now Ida finally decides to do a push and cut. Okay. And Ida makes this move. And then Shibano played what I consider to be the gaming winning move, which is the cut here. Now, basically, the idea behind this cut is obviously why we have to capture this black stone. That's the only move. Uh, and then black can play this beautiful Atari here. Now, notice that white cannot connect, obviously, because that would be that. So white has to take. So what that means is black will play here. And now notice that two white groups are now in Atari, and this is the more important one. So white has to connect. So 
you, you notice that basically in effect by luring Ida into the push and cut entitling um, his own liberties Shibano was able to destroy the eye in the middle in Sente and then Shibano comes back and kills this white group and then Ida decides to um, play some moves just trying to confuse Shibano so Shibano's not having any of it so now notice that for white to mount as an attack against this black group over here white has to connect here but notice that white is actually not really alive down here so uh, so anyway either decides to have a crack at um, testing Shibano And after this move, Ida resigned. So after the the game, we, let's look at the rankings. So Shibano Toramaru has played six games and won five. He's currently ranked first. Uh, coming in second is Ichiki Ryo at six for four, and Shida Asuya at six for four. And if you look at the upcoming schedule, Ichiriki is yet to play Shu Chaoyuan, which is a very strong player, obviously, and Shida Tetsuya. So Ichiriki and Shida will you know, fight it out to see who comes, you know, second at least. But Shibano has Shu Chaoyuan coming up, so that's a very tough game. And also Hane Na Naoki. So uh, so that's which which is Shibano is expected to win. So there's a good chance, in fact, 60%, 63% that Shida Toramaru will win the league and challenge Yamayuta for the title.